Hello everyone, welcome to another video by Scrapping It With Kids. So today we went out uh, and we thought, oh, let's see what's around the streets and if we can find some uh, goodies. So just to show you guys some of the things we found. We've got a golf buggy here, really good Nick. Um, we've got some fence there, some plastic fencing. We've got a PC. We've got a lot of cords, you probably can't see it, but there's so many underneath here. I'd say we've got about 20, 30 um, kilo of cords. We've got these blades. They're cool as one of my mates actually from work is riding now, so perfect timing. We've got a bike stand here, looks like for a motorbike. I'll have to take it out to show you a bit more. We've got a couple of boards that we found and we actually have a big box of boards in here. Most of them are rusty as you can see it's been wet uh, recently but um, once they get their box out I'll show you guys some awesome boards in there. Um, we've also found a, looks like it's one of the CPUs still there but a uh, much bigger board here not sure what it's off but it was just sitting there also found a box of uh, hard drives and bits and pieces we've got a hockey stick we've got a lot of gas barbecue gas fittings we have uh, this is actually skiing sticks and we also have a gym set once I remove it um, probably see a bit better we've got Petter sports springs they're actually brand new they're still in boxes there's three of them there there's another two boxes just down there um, looks like it, they haven't even been used plenty of uh, DVD players satellite boxes we have a laptop aluminium rim plenty of routers cords, gas fittings, so quite a good day overall really. And in here we have a, we have a snowboard and this picture here is actually of Melbourne but somebody drew it. It's a really cool picture so once I get it out again I'll show you um, what else did we find? Oh, there's so much stuff underneath there. I'll have to pull most of it all out just to show you guys. Um, yes. So we have some... We have a PS3. We have quite a few joysticks. Oh, there goes that joystick. We have a V that so quite a few bits and pieces all the cables everything is there PS3 um, I've probably missed a few things but uh, once I start unloading and getting them out We'll do another video. Oh yeah, sewing machine, just in there. Looks like he's pretty good, Nick. A lot of these uh, internet routers. So yeah, overall it's uh, been quite quite good uh, couple of hours. Now it's the fun part, unloading it all. So we'll see you shortly. Okay, so the ute's been emptied. Let's have a look at some of the finds. So this is a picture of Melbourne. And if I zoom in a little bit, you can actually see it's actually been drawn. So it's a really cool painting of Melbourne. So it does have a bit of water damage on the sides there, but uh, 
it's actually really really nice I like it so I might have to hang it up somewhere okay so this is the bike stand motorbike stand we found some sort of instrument holder this is the box of all the motherboards and I don't know it's got all sorts of stuff here so. not sure what this is here I am March this is German maybe um. Phillips it's got some boards cards see it's been obviously in the rain for a, for a while um, but what I wanted to show you is these chips here they've actually they have gold uh, plated pins I'm not sure if you can see it I'm trying to zoom in but uh, looks like a very old board so that's pretty cool there's quite a few boards, I'm not going to go through them just now, uh, I'll go through them later, and uh, some power boards, some other boards I think, all sorts. Found some tools, a couple of shovels, which is cool. Now look at these, I'm assuming these are for pizza baking pizza. They in really good nick actually. I think they're al aluminium too. So, it's quite a few of them. Found some netting. This will be handy for our farm. I'm gonna have to put the light on to show you the rest. I'll pull this buggy up also. This buggy is so cool. Pull it up and show you in a sec. Okay, so that's what the buggy actually looks like. It has a seat on the side, and uh, it's got a compartment for your belongings, bowls, umbrella. It has a brake. It's actually really, really smooth buggy. So they actually sell really good. We'll see what we get for that. So what you're looking at here is Perez Sports Coil Springs. So we've got the front and rear and to be honest they're actually brand new. They still have stickers on them and three of them are actually in a box. So yeah not a bad find. If you ask me. And inside the house, we found this cool timber game board, which is also chess. Kids are already playing with that. And my son picked up this little bike. Alright. Let's go down to the garage. Okay. So these are some of the DVD players. Satellite boxes. There's a Foxtel box there, actually. Talking about Foxtel boxes. I've got roughly about 18 of these. Which I have to start pulling apart. These are your network routers, modems. There's a whole box of them, which uh, also need to be cleaned out. We also found this cricket helmet, nice little cricket helmet. A couple more routers there. This is the sewing machine down here. A couple of other computer bits and pieces in that box. All the barbecue fittings, 
Got a few in there. Remove all this brass, nice brass. Um, for now, that's all of our cable there that needs to be processed. So, quite a bit in there. These are the two boards that we also found. Uh, CPU is still in it. This is the other board. It's actually a really big board, this one. It's got two CPUs. There was nothing in there. But there will be a CPU there. Um, and then we found this PC. And there is a laptop somewhere, but I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, it's all the way under here. I'm not sure if you can see it. Um, so, and also in the front seat, I still have the PlayStation 3 and the Wii. It's a couple of consoles, which is awesome. Nice pickups. Look at that nice shiny stuff there. Alright, guys. Um, Thank you for watching, and uh, it's been a good day. Had fun, found plenty of things, as you can see, and uh, yeah, we enjoyed ourselves. Okay, good night from Melbourne, and have a safe evening or day, wherever you might be. Okay, bye for now.